Ah, oh, guys, I'm back. Um, blue one. On my last video, I stated that we're going to do some work in this on this one in June, and uh, um, today I'm going to start just to put her up in the air, rear wheels off, have a look underneath, and see what we're dealing with, reference to brake pipes, etc. Um, but everything's going to be renewed, new back plates new arms, subframe mountings, brake pipes, hopefully the fuel pipe will be all right. Um, I'm gonna drop the petrol tank, and then we're gonna, once it's all stripped out from underneath, what we're gonna do is gonna paint the floor performance blue. Um, I'd like some of your feedback, guys, because what I was thinking is with the rear subframe, you get that sandblasted, and then I'm going to have that painted performance blue. So it'll be performance blue floor with rear subframe, black, but with black arms. The disc, the back plates on the back of the disc, paint in blue with um, blue calipers. New discs, obviously, because as I said before, the discs on this are disgusting. So... That is what we're intention of doing. Might have to replace some of the heat shields under there. But uh, back to what I said before, once we're up in the air, then we'll know what we're dealing with. But I will keep you updated. So there's going to be a couple of videos now on the blue one. So, yeah. So I will return once she's up in the air on axle stands, and I'll give you an update. Right. She's up in the air, guys, as you can see. Um, I've had a quick nosy underneath. I remember I said about the discs. Look how bad they are. So they're going to be renewed. Going to go for final facelift um, rear calipers. Going to put new back plates on and have them painted performance blue. All new trailing arms. New drop links, new suspension legs, springs, top mounts, um, subframe, rear subframe, or oh, excuse me, she knows, rear subframe can be rebushed. I won't put poly bushes, I'll stick to the full ones, standard ones, um, anti-roll bar, new bushes for that. I'm going to paint, I leave the anti-roll bar black, but the subframe, um, as I said, I would like your input about having performance blue rear subframe. But around the other side, obviously, is the same. Look at the date state of the disc. I know it ain't been used for a long time, but the discs have come to the end of their life. The same old thing again. Final facelift rear calipers. And, uh, um, yeah, so once that's done, drop the petrol tank, then we've got to see what the um, fuel lines are like. The RS rims are here. Um, Going to have these refurbed, um, laser cut fascias and silver, sprinkle silver paint. <clears throat> trouble is some guy had his done laser cut fascia and they all went milky so now obviously I don't want to spend that to have these laser cut and in a little while down the road they start going milky so I don't know someone did tell me that there's this um, like a diesel stuff well, not a diesel, it's like a, a sealer you can put on them once they've been laser cut, but you've got to do it before you have the rubber put on. So, but yeah, these are the um, spacers I use with the RS rims. They're only, they're H&R um, 15 mil, I do believe. H&R uh, 15 mil. So, yeah, well, look, the old jacking point covers, I took them off, put them in the garage. I've took these off 
obviously these have all be cleaned and put back with new clips and that but obviously I had to take these off to get us sitting on the axle stands properly so yeah so that's it guys um i just got to do a list and uh, um get, i've got to get some gas because then bolts ain't going to come out without any heat on and the next next one it'll be stripping out put taking out the liners stripping out the uh rear suspension and uh putting it all back new there's a little bit of welding on this car to be done on i think it's this side so happens so when the guy's doing the infra i'll get him to do this so it'll be done so yeah so that's it for today guys that's the update on i'm going to call this pb project one so look out for it and that will be it pb project one is for this one so yeah so take guy care guys if you like it thumbs up if you don't then thumbs down but i'd like to have a bit of intake from you guys reference to the performance blue subframe and back plates etc so take care guys look after yourself